You go for it, Chris. Yeah. I can't believe how low what how low the rotor speed is on this. Yeah, like a helicopter is the 700 size of the helicopter. Yeah. And it's only 900 grams. <laughs> only three cell lithium ion, not lithium polymer, lithium ion cells. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very low current, like only 20 amps. At, uh, 20 RPM, amps. Yeah. But you can even do like 3D with it. What? Yeah. <laughs> Fully capable. And 3D printed rotor head. <laughs> 3D print, printed rotor head. Yeah. <laughs> it was the uh, it was my engineering bachelor uh, thesis. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. From For the your studies. thesis. Exactly. Yes. For the study of. The wow. To take your hobby into doing your uh, exactly. degree thesis. Yeah. With like like that. Very unusual to see a 700 it's, size helicopter. Do you inside. know what? Normally, when I film <laughs> yeah. these size helicopters yeah, with their very fast head speeds, I'm terrified. No way, yeah. I'm terrified of flying them. But this is such a low rotor speed, it's yeah. almost, I feel quite comfortable exactly. being this close you, to it. You lost the fear. Like, <laughs> I've lost the, the fear. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, quite fun to fly. Very I bet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's still very, very agile despite yeah. the low head speed. And the tail rotor is actually like a separate process motor in the back. Right. Beautiful. <laughs> Just get a close up of that, the head. Yeah, it's uh, like laser sintered nylon plastic. And the blade, uh, the blade grips are carbon fiber. That is why. Wow. And even the rotor blades are self made and made from spread tower carbon fiber. It has a foam core inside, and um, on the outside, there's only one skin of carbon fiber. Right. It's very lightweight. Right. Right. Fantastic. Thanks very much, Chris. Yeah. Again, another fantastic piece of model engineering.